Hi again Breakfast Serial Eaters and welcome to another edition of What's in the Box. So what have we got this time? Well, Weetabix are really busy at the minute because they've got not one, not two, but three new different Weetos variations. Let's take a look. So uh, here we've actually got the new Weetos caramel flavour and it's interesting they call it new rather than limited edition because uh, it implies that maybe they're going to be keeping this on for a bit. So uh, there's the front of the pack looking all very caramelly and on the back of the pack it's the usual health blurb. So a bit of a shame that they've not done anything more interesting. I mean when Weetos first came out you got free toys and gifts and everything else in it but uh, no they seem to have pretty much sort of gone down the uh, non-mascot general market health route so a uh, bit of a shame um, before I actually move on though it's worth actually showing this one as well because this is in the supermarket as well this is Weetos honeycomb flavor so again very similar packaging says new and on the back in exactly the same way this too is also focusing on the health stuff. So uh, having looked at these, I'll show you, uh, I've still got a few left. I've munched my way through them. They look like just standard Weetos. So uh, it's just purely the flavoring that's uh, different. So there's uh, no difference in color or anything like that. Personally, I found these a little bit sweet actually. So they weren't really uh, uh, my cup of tea, but, I did love this one. So uh, this is Weetos orange flavor. And on this one, you'll see it does very clearly say limited edition at the top. And uh, you can, I think, still buy this in some shops, although it's limited availability now as well. But uh, this really did taste nice. I really enjoyed these ones. So uh, again, on the back, it's the usual health blurb, sadly. And as you'll see, I do still eat normal Weetos. This is a current packet that I've just finished off. Uh, and again, it's got exactly the same sort of health uh, details on the back. And I've only just noticed it actually, very clearly saying, loved by kids, approved by parents. So uh, clearly the parents have approved for there to be no free gifts. Now, whilst showing these new variations, I thought it might be interesting just to show how Weetos have evolved over the years. So, uh, started off in 1987 with uh, this one here, and Derek, who was the mascot at the time, obviously promoting these free yo-yos and Weetos, and very clearly saying new on the front. And then there was the uh, story on the back about uh, Derek being miserable. And again, this was TV advert at the time around this. That was then followed in 2005 with these, which is Weetos Honey. Fairly short-lived, only lasted for, a, I think, probably a couple of years and uh, then was replaced again. But it was nice to see that Weetabix were actually trying different types of uh, cereal flavours, actually, with their Weetos. They then tried the uh, Weetos Multigrain Stars. So this one replaced the actual Weetos Honey anyway. So this was in uh, 2006. And you'll see, again, you've got the traditional Weetos, but uh, you've got these uh, multi-grain stars, which are very reminiscent of the uh, ones that were in the multi-grain Kellogg's cereal as well at the time. In 2008, we had new Weetos Meteors. So the stars have suddenly gone chocolate flavor, but you've still got Weetos plus the balls, or Meteors, I should say. And the great thing is on the back, you've got an interactive piece on the packet as well. So uh, all sorts of things going on there, but that was good fun to see. In 2011, we got Weetos versus Alien Invaders. And there was an advert for this as well, which I'll feature at the very end of this uh, film. And uh, on the back, you've obviously got, uh, again, another graphic of these uh, two fighting it out with their lightsabers. And finally, in 2014, We've got Weetos with waffles. So the waffles look a bit like those alien invaders I showed a moment ago, but uh, uh, these two, fairly short-lived. So uh, they've certainly tried different things with uh, Weetos over the years. Uh, hopefully the chocolate orange one, I know it was limited edition, will come back. Uh, as to the honeycomb and caramel, well, I'm sure they'll be popular with some people. And uh, 
All credit to Weetabix for actually introducing new stuff and new varieties. But please, I just wish they would include something on the back of the packet that you could do and was interactive. I'm sick of reading all the sort of ingredients and the health stuff on these. Derek lives in a world that's boring. <sighs> Almost as boring as his breakfast. He searched the four corners of the world for something exciting. When suddenly, the answer came out of the blur. New wheat house. Crunchy whole wheat hoops with a delicious chocolate taste. This could be the shape of things to come. Wheat house. From wheat to beaks. They're not square. I'm limbering up and I'm away! Hurdles, brilliant! Mornings on Nick, powered by new Weetos Alien Invaders. Feel the burn. Time for my morning workout! Alright! Mornings on Nick, powered by new Weetos Alien Invaders. As always, if you're interested in this and other cereal items, please subscribe to this channel, like and share it, or visit my website, cerealoffers.com. Click on Weetabix. And then we toes.